I'm Jan Lee and I'm the owner of Bodrick in uh, Soho and we're a modern East Asian uh, restaurant and bar. The food here is very cross-cultural so lots of Korean, Chinese and Japanese influences and all um, and mixed with uh, European dishes. I always ask the team to try to experiment and to, to play with different things. We're very open, not just in the kitchen but also in the bar. Growing up in the UK, you know, I've, you know, I've you know, grown up with the UK food but having a, a Hong Kong heritage as well, I've, I've always had cross-cultural uh, foods and, and also with my wife coming here she was very interested in European culture. So everything that we do, we always look for that connection between the two, two, two cultures and, and, and that's come across in the restaurant as well. <laughs> Our signature dish, I would say, is the Korean fried chicken. And in, in London you get lots of fried chicken, but here we wanted to recreate something that we tried in, in Korea. And it's a specific dish, you know, one that, that you know, we worked really hard on. And we didn't start off with the Korean fried chicken on the menu. And, took six months or so and, and we've you know, come up with something that we're very happy with and you know, hopefully the customers will too. I would be having a better time if I didn't have to eat. I usually do. I love it. I think the atmosphere is fantastic. I love this table heading all the way down. I think that's a really interesting feature. My favourite thing was got to be the ropes here. There's something special about those ropes. It's very flavoursome, you know, and you can try a lot of different kind of barbecued ropes, and some of them can be very dry and boring. Um, but this one not only was just a great kind of smoky flavour, but it also just, I don't know, it had something extra to it. That extra flavour was there, and that's what made it interesting. Um, and it's hard to put your finger on what that was, but that's where the fusion stuff comes in, right? That's the bit that intrigues, get you interested, and gets you coming back. I had a few of them, so it obviously went down well. And that's after eating a load of other food at the earlier restaurants, so... For me, that's uh, a good hallmark of a winner. I think it's important for people to be able to get inspiration from new things and to be able to bring new flavors and new cuisines in on the in this kind of mix. And I think actually customers are starting to, to seek out both ends of that spectrum. They're starting to look for the things that are more curated, more individual, more more kind of raw and authentic. But also they're looking for new ideas, new flavors, new new things, new inspiration. I really like it. Actually, it's it's kind of a bar service on bills which really like very casual you can go by yourself you can go three five ten people cocktails really good actually it's classic american comfort food but with a, kind of a bit of a twist really well spiced for me it's very light on the asian which which works well they're not trying to pretend something it's not so doing something the, the core is really good the chicken wings you know it's, it's classic Southwest American style. It's all done really well. It's just a very light Asian on top. So in a crowded environment, it, it, it stands up on it on its own. Um, so yeah, I think they've done it really well. Really happy. I think the chicken wings because they're a difficult thing to get right because it's a chicken wing, so it's not that that good on its own. But it's so crispy and so well spiced, and it felt like a treat. 